WJNB TV News. Coach, how does it feel to coach so many NFL prospects and All Americans? Well, I think uh, the guys are doing a great job. Uh, up front on the D line, I think Yurik Bethune, he's doing a great job, number 51. Uh, we have a lot of scouts coming around looking at him. Uh, our linebacker that we have, uh, number 20, Holloway. He's doing an awesome job. He runs very well. He's making a lot of plays. I think he's leading us in tackles. And in our secondary, we have Dylan Hamilton. Uh, he's a returning all SWAC member, and he's doing a, He's coming back with another superb year. He's a great tackler in the open field, and he gets our guys lined up. Well, that's good, that's good. The energy that we have this year coming in, uh, we are at number two, are we tied number two in the SWAC here? Yes, we're, we're, we're number one. We're tied, number one. Tied, tied for number one, my bad, apologies. Um, do you, how do you feel like this energy will follow until next year? Well, that's what we're trying. We're here. We just not got here with the new staff, and uh, that's what we're trying to bring here. We're trying to bring a different pedigree to the uh, environment, and uh, hopefully, everybody will buy in. Uh, we have a, a young, young, young group of guys. We only have 12 guys uh, that are leaving, uh, that are seniors, and so hopefully, we can build this year, and we can continue to rise as we go along. Who are some of the young stars that you feel will be able to carry the torch going into the next year with some of the seniors leaving? Well, just like I said, uh, Holloway is one of our great uh, juniors that uh, he's, he's really up and coming. Uh, and all he needs to do is gain some weight. He's a small linebacker, but he runs so well. And, he, and he's, he's making some great tackles. Uh, from that, uh, I think our quarterback, Glass, uh, next year I think he, he's going to be a senior and uh, he, he's going to be a great leader for us. So uh, we have some guys that are going to step up. Uh, we have some freshmen that we think are going to make some good plays. Uh, uh, Caleb Riley, uh, and number 12, uh, AJ. AJ, AJ gonna be a great player for us right now. Those guys are just young right now, very, really immature, but they have a lot of talent. And uh, hopefully they'll mature a little bit this spring and uh, they'll come back and be ready to start, be good, great starters for the next year. Up here on the hill, how do you feel like the energy is with the new football program? How do you feel? Well, uh, the people are very excited about the things that the staff and the players are doing this year. And uh, I think the energy level is very high. What I, what I understand is the uh, attendance has been up this year, and that's a great start for a new staff and some new players here. It really is, it really is. How does it feel working with Coach Manning? Well, it's great working with a coach that has been a, such a winner. Uh, you know, he he's everywhere he's been, he's won. And uh, right now we're establishing a winning environment around here. That's what uh, the guys have to buy into. Working at one of Alabama's most historic HBCUs. Well, actually, it's great. I, I never thought I would work at HBCU, but uh, the people around here are awesome. Uh, it's great to be involved with the family members that, you know, that look just like yourself and uh, represent the things that you want to represent. And uh, this has been a great experience for me and my family. Uh, we're glad to be here in Huntsville, Alabama.
Bartlett, the Vijay Vinci Villas.